Dear students, welcome to SCPS Online Live Class, Class 8, English version. This is your Kamral sir. I am fine and I hope you are also fine by the grace of Almighty Allah. Dear students, today we will discuss again exercise 5.2 and it will be our part 2. In the previous class, you know, already we uh, discussed on exercise 5.2. Now today we will discuss our last four creatives. Problem number 17, 18, 19 and 20. Now everyone take your math book and math copy. Go to the exercise 5.2 then you will be able to find four creative questions. Your uh, last part of the exercise 17, 18, 19 and 20 number. So dear students read you can go to the problem number 17 look 17 number problem said that there are three algebraic expressions are given in the information now question number a express the first expression into lowest form that means the first expression first fraction we have to make it as a lowest form clear dear students now we can start problem number 17 At first, we can write our first expression. This is a to the power 4 minus b to the power 4 a square minus 2ab plus b square. Dear students, this is our given expression or you can say fraction, no problem. Now look, we know for any problem, for any operation, at first we have to factorize the given expression. Now here numerator and denominator. Look, this is the denominator s square minus 2ab plus b square. We can write a minus b whole square. And this one we can write as a, a square whole square minus b square whole square. So now we will be able to apply the formula s square minus b square. So it will be a plus b and another one a minus b here s square indicate a and b square as indicate b so this is our term another a minus b whole square and look a minus b whole square means a minus b into a minus b so you can write a minus b into a minus b or also you can write a minus b whole square not necessary to write this one here now this one s square plus b square look s square minus b square also we can apply formula a plus b a minus b now this a minus b a minus b if we minimize so this is our answer so we can write our answer is a square plus b square another one a plus b and this is a minus b so this is our lowest form from problem number a here dear students Okay, now go to the problem number B. Show that the product of the three expression is this. So we have to show that the given three expression, their product will be according to the question number B. Clear dear students. So now we can try. Is it right or wrong? This is the answer of A. Clear. Now we will write to the problem number B. B number we have to multiply by 3 fraction. So what is the f first right? a to the power 4 minus b to the power 4 a square minus 2ab plus b square. This is first one. Second one a minus b a cube minus b cube uh, a cube plus b cube. Third one f plus b a cube plus b cube so dear students this is our three expression or three fraction now we have to multiply then their product will be according to the problem number b if we write then we will be able to write just show it clear now first look this is already uh, from a we get the answer as like a square plus b square 
a plus b a minus b you can write because problem number a already you show it that this is the lowest form of this one so we will be able to write directly why because problem number a already show it now this one a minus b a cube plus b cube now what is the answer and look a cube plus b cube their factorization we get in the formula a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square and this one f plus b this is also a cube plus b cube so we can write f plus b a square minus a b plus b square so our factorization finished now we need to minimize so this f plus b and this f plus b are vanish this f plus b and this one are vanish this a minus b and this a minus b are vanish so we can say our remaining part a square plus b square this one and this and this look both are same so we can write a square minus a b plus b square as a whole square now look your problem number b we have to show that their product is this this is the similar to question number b part so our answer is same so we can say this is show very simple so our answer is correct their production uh, their product is this one so we can say this is our short part okay dear student go to the problem number c divide the first expression by this one look a cube plus a square b plus a b square plus b cube a plus b whole square minus 4 a b cube by this expression we have to divide the first expression that means this we have to divide and another part add a square by a plus b to the quotient you get after division we will get the answer uh, with this answer we have to add a square by a plus b so problem number c there are two part okay now we can go problem number c so at first we have to divide now write c number first expression now we have to we have to divide it by c number question set that we have to divide by a minus b whole square plus 4ab and uh, sorry a plus b whole square minus 4ab and upward side is a cube plus a square b plus a b square plus b cube this is the numerator now at first we have to factorize very good now this is already factorized in problem number a we can write a square plus b square f plus b into a minus b divided by a minus b now this is division sign we can a plus b whole square minus 4ab we can write a minus b whole square this is the corollary of a minus b whole square now this one these two part we can take as a common a square so it will be a plus b and there if we take common as a b square so it will be a plus b this two part this two one is common and this two part is common now we can write a square plus b square a plus b and another one a minus b now this division sign we can give multiplication so it will be a minus b whole square the fraction will be interchange reciprocal now this one here f plus b f plus b is a common now it will be a square plus b square so our factorization done now we can minimize a square plus b square and a square plus b square f plus b f plus b this a minus b and this a minus b whole square so after minimization one a minus b will be remaining so this is our answer if we divide first expression by this one we will get the answer this now our third part we have to add a square by a plus b with this one so we can now now a minus b plus 
square by a plus b. And we have to add a square by a plus b with the quotient of this. So a minus b. Now look a plus b and there one is a denominator. So there is LCM a plus b. So we can write a plus b into a minus b and this is plus a square. So dear students in this place I can write now look a plus b into a minus b. So we can write a square minus b square and this plus a square and this one a plus b. So a square plus a square we can write 2 a square minus b square and this one a plus b. So 2 a square b square 2 a square minus b square uh, by a plus b. So this is the, our final answer of problem number c. Very simple just step by step you uh, should to solve it then you will get the your final answer. Clear dear students very simple. Now 18 number uh, this is uh, so much easiest question for you. B number you have to the lowest form look it and C number you have to convert as a common denominator. Already we solved it. So we can go to the problem number 19 and 20. Dear student, 19 and 20 uh, both are similar type of maths. So if we solve any one, then another one you will be able to solve. Clear? So I can solve uh, problem number 19, suppose. Uh, then 20 you can start. Go to the problem number 19. Look, 19 number problem a equal x minus 2 b equal x square plus twice x plus 4 and c equal x cube minus 8 are three algebraic expression now this uh, algebraic expression now number a find out the sum of this uh, so this math uh, out of stem out of information and you know problem number a uh, it can be uh, out part of stem now B number simplify this one, one is information given and C number we have to prove that. Clear dear students you can see it. Now we can solve number A, find out the sum. So 19 number, number A, A by BC plus B by CA plus C by AB and another one plus a minus b by sc so this is our question we have to find the sum so now look what is the lcm lcm will be abc so if we divide by abc by bc answer will be a now multiply this will be a square similarly we have to divide multiply b square there c c square and there is b so if we multiply by b this will be a b minus b square now dear students this is a b c now b square and this b square will be vanish so we can write a square plus a b plus c square so we can write this is our answer a square plus a b plus c square by a b c so this is the answer of a very simple part now b number simplify this one so we need at first write the question b number b number we have to simplify now this is 1 by a into x minus 2 divided by b plus 6x by c now dear students, what is the meanings of A, B, C? This is the information of our step. A equal, we can write x minus 2. So we need to input the value for A, x minus 2. For B, we can write x square plus twice x plus 4. And for C, we can write x cube minus 8. So this is our 
part so at first we need to factorize now look there is no factorization this one x minus 2 but we can factorize this one so it will be x square plus um, we can write 2 a no this is not possible clear so we can say this is uh, this will be unchanged because we can factorize this is and this one there is middle term not possible clear so now go to the this one 6x and x cube minus 8 we can write x cube minus 2 cube now just to, we can minimize this one this and this this is multiplication sign we can minimize because there is no factorization now we can write 1 by x square plus twice x plus 4 and this is plus x cube minus 2 cube so it will be a minus b a cube minus b cube a minus b into a square plus a b that means twice x plus b square b square that means 2 2 square that means 4 we can write directly 4 and this one 6 now dear students this two one they are lcm this so we can write lcm x minus 2 x square plus 2i6 plus 4 this is the lcm now if we divide answer x minus 2 into 1 x minus 2 if we divide answer 1 1 into this 6x so we can write the finalize now what will be the answer dear students x minus 2 and x this x we can write 7x minus 2 7x minus 2 and this one x minus 2 x square plus 2x plus 4 for replacing this one you can write x cube minus 8 because x cube minus 8 if we factorize you will get this one so we can write this because this is our lowest part for replacing this you can write this one so we can say this is our simplification this is our answer yeah if we write this one replacing x cube minus a you will get marks but it is necessary to write okay dear students now c number we have to prove that here we have to prove that so at first write the word question part c number You can say left hand side or you can say now equal this part, no problem. 1 by a x plus 2 by b and divided by x plus 2 by c. So this is our question. Now we have to show that after simplification it answer will be 1. This is our target. So now we can write we know a equal x minus 2 sorry multiplication and b equal x square plus 2i6 plus 4 divide and c equal x cube minus it so at first we have to input the value now we need to factorize this is not factorized and this one also we can factorize now division if we write multiplication so this x plus 2 it will be here and x cube minus 8 for it you can write uh, x cube minus 2 cube division is a multiplication this interchange now this x plus 2 this x plus 2 we can minimize no problem now here 1 by x minus 2 here 1 by x square plus 2x plus 4 and this one we can write as a 1 and this one x minus 2 x square plus 2x plus 4 now x minus 2 and this x minus 2 we can minimize x square plus 2x plus 2 this end so all are minimized so we can say this is 1 so this is our right hand side so dear students we can say 
this is correct so after simplification it will get the one clear dear student so 17 18 19 and 20 this four maths so much important maths today we will solve 17 and 19 i think now you will be able to solve another two one problem number 18 that is very simple and another one 20 number so this two one is still homework you will be able to solve it okay dear students so we can complete our exercise 5.2 in the next class we will try chapter 6 exercise 6.1 thank you no more today